Porsche has expanded the 911 product line with the GTS models. From March 2017, a total of five variants will be available in Germany, the 911 Carrera GTS with rear-wheel drive, the 911 Carrera 4 GTS with all-wheel drive, both of the above available as a coupe and cabriolet, and the 911 Targa 4 GTS with all-wheel drive. A newly developed turbocharger for 3.0-liter six-cylinder flat engine increases power to 331 kilowatts, 450 PS. The engine delivers 22 kilowatts, 30 horsepower, more than the 911 Carrera S and 15 kilowatts, 20 horsepower, more than the corresponding GTS prior model with a naturally aspirated engine. All variants are available with a manual 7-gear transmission or optional 4-stop or Kelung, PDK. More power for more performance. The maximum torque of 550 Nm provides even better acceleration and elasticity figures. The torque is available between 2150 and 5000 revolutions per minute. Porsche Active Suspension Management PASM, is included as standard on all GTS models. The GTS coupes feature the PASM Sports chassis, which lowers the body by 10 mm. The fastest sprinter in the family is the 911 Carrera 4 GTS Coupe, with Porsche Doppel Kelung, PDK, and the Sport Chrono package as standard, it races from 0 to 100 km per hour in 3.6 seconds. All GTS models feature a top speed in excess of 300 km per hour. The front runner at 312 km per hour is the coupe with manual transmission and rear wheel drive. Despite the increase in performance, the GTS remains efficient, the 911 Carrera GTS with PDK, for example, consumes only 8.3 liters slash 100 km according to the NED. This corresponds to CO2 emissions of 188 grams slash km. Porsche 911 GTS, 2018 2018 Porsche 911 GTS Typical GTS, numerous black elements both inside and out. The GTS models stand out within the 911 model line not only in terms of technology, but also in their visual design. All of the vehicles are based on the wide all-wheel drive chassis, which measures 1,852 mm even on the rear-wheel drive models.